everybody, David and David here from payitforward.com and upvote.com. And in this video, we're going to explain what to do when you see lines on your iPhone screen. It's almost always a hardware problem, which is not the best news, but we need to eliminate the possibility of a software problem first, especially because those are the easiest to eliminate. Mm -hmm. So the first thing to try is a hard reset. Yeah. So I got my phone here. If you have an iPhone 8 or newer, mm -hmm. press and release volume up, press and release volume down, press and hold side button iPhone 7, it's the volume down button and the side button. iPhone 6S or older, it's the home button and the power button. Yep, hold those together. Yep. With the iPhone 7, hold the buttons together and just hold them for 30 seconds. Yep. Don't give up too soon. Are you gonna do it? Yeah, I'll do it. All right. Volume up, volume down, side. Yep, press and hold. You just keep holding until the Apple logo appears on the screen and then let go. Might take a while. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, it might take a while. Over here. All right, there it is. So if that didn't work for you, the next thing to do to completely roll out a software problem is a DFU Restore first, back up your iPhone before you do the DFU Restore, and then check out our DFU Restore walkthrough video. There's a card above, and there's a link in the description section below. Okay, we've eliminated the software problem. You DFU Restored it, or maybe you just know that it's a hardware problem because let's get honest, you <laughs> dropped it on the floor and then it started to happen. It got wet, you have an older iPhone that's not water resistant, or it had a crack in it, newer iPhone, and dropped it in the toilet, and then the screen started to have lines. If that's the case, it's probably a hardware problem. The good news is that if you dropped it and it started to happen, and it doesn't seem like there's much wrong with it, mm -hmm. there's a chance that you can fix it yourself with what I used to call the MacGyver trick. Can I right. do it on your phone? Go maybe? crazy. Thanks. So the way iPhones work is in the upper right-hand corner of the screen, like around this area, just say up in here, there are logic board connectors that connect the logic board of the iPhone to the display. And if you just, press down sort of lightly in here in this area of your phone, sometimes that will reseat the connectors because if you drop them, for instance, they can become loose. I was in an AT&T store about a year ago and a woman came in with a broken iPhone and I fixed her phone on the spot just by pressing down on the right side of her iPhone. And it could be kind of confusing for people because, okay, they did drop it, but there's no physical damage. If you were to go to the Apple store with that problem, mm -hmm. they would just open it up, hopefully if they're good techs, open it up and fix the problem for you right off the bat. But otherwise, just yeah. try that first. But don't press too hard or you can crack the screen yeah. and then void your warranty, so be careful. Yep. Yeah. If that doesn't work and if it might not, uh, you gotta get it repaired. Yep. Apple store, always a great bet. A link to some third party repair companies, card above, in the description section below. Or if you don't wanna pay for a new repair, you just get a new phone. Get a new phone, upphone.com. Yep. It's the best place to compare cell phones and cell phone plans. There are some great deals right now. Mm -hmm. Check them out on Upphone. Yeah. And yeah, if your iPhone is under warranty, try Apple first. Yep. If it's not under warranty, you might want to try one of those yep. third-party repair shops. Especially when you drop it or water damage. You can damage other things other than the screen. Yep. So. And if that's the case, it could be really expensive yep. through Apple. Yeah, so that's what to do when you see lines on your iPhone screen. Thanks for watching. Give this video a thumbs up. If you enjoyed, leave a comment down below with any other questions if that MacGyver solution worked for you. We'd love to hear it. Mm -hmm. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more great iPhone videos.